Hi, I am Jack, and I like video games. How are you doing this lovely evening? It is 8.13 p.m. Central Standard Time here on February 9th, 2000. Excuse me. 2023. How's your night going? Hope you're doing very well. Welcome, everyone. Hope your February's going well. We're back. Going to be playing some Satisfactory tonight. Thank you again, everyone who's tuned in. Everyone who's watched. You can watch my archives at YouTube.com. Slash Jack Patillo, if you want to go over there and watch my previous stuff, any of the previous uh, streams we've done, you go check that out over there. And as a matter of fact, I'm giving everyone one more day. So I streamed me building the Lego Star Destroyer. You can see it right here, the, the nose of it right there. All of the episodes are up on my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Jack Patillo. You can go there, watch them. I gave a secret code word at some point during all six of those streams. And I have a Google form where if you go to that form, it's in the chat right now, you do exclamation point form, and you put in all six code words in your email, I'm going to randomly select someone from that form to win a gift card to the Lego store because Lego should be shared. Hi Cooper, you can't win. You're, you're too closely related, related to me. Also, you have no thumbs. Well, you kind of have thumbs because you've got extra bonus fingers. But you can't win Lego. You wouldn't know what to do with them. Just move my mic wherever you want, buddy. That's cool. Just I, I like talking into it. But anyway, go check it out. Fill in the form. Uh, I'm giving everyone a little bit more time. Maybe tomorrow, maybe next week. Who knows? But it's ending very, very soon. So if you want to try to win a Lego gift card that you can use to purchase Lego, go watch those streams. Fill in the form. And we'll and we'll we'll draw. All right, let's get into the game. I almost just ended the stream. I almost hit the button to end the stream right there. That would have been that would have been bad. Hang on, Katie's Katie's yelling at me. She says, "Could you pretty please close the door? I'm sorry." My God, how rude! How rude! You're trapped now. Cooper and Ellie, you're in here with me. You're trapped in here with me. That's a that's a quote from a movie. Anyway, all right, let's play some Satisfactory. So last time we played, I literally haven't opened this since the last time. Why is there a bouncy dude down there? I haven't opened this since the last time we played. Uh, so I'm literally standing where where I finished last time. Did I? There we go. No, there's the right keyboard. So as you guys know, uh, last time we started working on the aluminum, we started expanding our aluminum factory. And uh, we're going to continue that this this episode. So, uh, yeah, last time we did pretty much everything. We had our uh, bauxite. We have our coal coming in, uh, feeding directly in, and then it becomes alumina solution with water right there. And then it gets turned into uh, aluminum scrap. That aluminum scrap is then brought over here and turned into aluminum ingots. We currently... Um, don't have enough silica so i need 125 per minute of silica one two three four five six so 125 times six i need 750 silica these three machines here produce nope not that one these machines over here <laughs> produce 50 per minute of silica, so one, two, three, four, five. So that's 250 silica being produced, which means I need to come up with 500 silica per minute to send over to these guys to get them to be properly producing aluminum ingots. And at that point, they'll be, they'll, they'll be producing 500, 600 aluminum ingots per minute pretty rad so what we need to do to, to start is we need oh yeah here let's okay so we can do over here aluminum factory so this is good we need 600 we got all that so this is all this is all gold we need 500 silica per minute to produce 600 aluminum ingots. All right. 
So, we need to find 500 silica a minute. Which, I think I looked this up last time when we were here. How's my inventory? Good. Okay, so... Uh, toss that. So, why do I have that on me? Toss that. So, we need to make... The thing that makes silica. Is it a constructor? Yeah. So, silica makes 37.5 a minute. 37.5. 500 divided by 37.5. is 13.5. Three. So, again, we can overclock one of them. So, that 13.3 repeating times 22.5. 13.3 times 24.5 is 300. So, I just need to get 300 quarts per minute, right? Just 300 quarts per minute. And, sorry, I'm getting a text from a friend. Uh... So, I need 300 quarts per minute. Let's take a look at where our nearest quart stations are. We are here. What is that? There's a bauxite node right there? So you're telling me I could double... So there's a bauxite node, like, right there? Well, I mean, we could expand this and double it up pretty easily. Although I would need to find more coal. Because this takes in what? I think it's 300 a minute, right? 100 per minute. Oh, oh geez. Whoa, whoa. Oh, oh Jesus. Autosave. Ah, ah. Alright, so these. So I'm taking 300 per minute there. So I need to get 300 more iron. Okay, well, we can figure that out. We'll deal with that later. So now, we need to get. 300 quarts per minute. Which means, where is our nearest quartz? There's some right here. Okay. Alright, quartz. Right there. Unfortunately, this one, these are the most direct ones. And then I get these guys here. I do have this quartz right here. Oh, it's pure as well. I've got quartz right here that is untouched. Hang on, Cooper one's out. So why don't we, before we get out of control, Let's go take a look at these these quartz nodes over there. Um, because I might just have to do a series of trains to get over to them. Speaking of trains, I wonder if I have enough. Let's just drop a train down. That will save me a lot of time. Transport. Oh, I do. Beautiful. Okay. Okay, let's go over to our train station. Oh, Miley, hey, what's up? It's good seeing you. Welcome back. Uh, team Last Pick, thank you very much. Five months of being awarded. Appreciate you. Thank you very much for that. All right. Is is the game play too loud? Let me know. I don't know if that game plays too loud. Seems pretty loud. But I could be wrong. Sounds good to me. I'm on mobile. All right. Pirate. If Pirate King says it's okay, I trust everyone. I trust them. Still got to figure out my storage solution. Do some sort of center over here, big storage area. We'll figure it out that going at some point. But right now I want to get my aluminum going. And so the goal is once we get the aluminum all being produced, we'll on the loud side I'll turn it. Once we get all of the aluminum being produced, what I want to do is then produce alclad sheets, um, casings, and uh, metal containers, whatever those things are. The things to package hydrogen. Nitrogen. 
And so that's what we're going to split our three things into. A mobile 2 sounds good even using a Bluetooth speaker, says Dark Mage. Miley, you got sensitive ears. That's okay. Katie's got very sensitive ears. She can hear everything. She probably heard me say that. All right, let's get over here. So you can see that there's a node right there. Literally not doing anything. So let's see what we can do with this. Okay. So we got this guy. This is producing 240 per minute. If I want to get that up to 300, what do I got to get it up to? 125. Totally. We can do that. We can make that happen. Okay. 300 parts a minute. There we are. So, with this, let's go ahead and produce the power. Why don't you have any power? So why are you chugging? You shouldn't be chugging at all. You should be, you should be producing. I thought we did you like one to one. Eh, whatever. Okay, I'll deal with it later. All right, <clears throat> I need constructors. So I need a bunch. Uh, constructor. Okay, I got plenty of stuff. All right, so let's go ahead and take our raw quartz. We will. Um, I feel like it's been a while since I played this, so bear with me while I kind of get my bearings back. That was a lot of B words. All right, let's clear out some trees. How did that one rock stay? Of all things. Okay. And here we are. We need, so 300 quartz. Constructor. So, <clears throat> 22.5 by, by, by 3. There it is. Uh, no, uh, 300 divided by 22.5. So, thir oh, same freaking number, Jack. Come on now. All right, 13, 3 repeating. So, I need, we'll say 14 constructors to make it a nice round number. So, what we can do, how much is that going to produce? 300? Yeah, okay. So, we'll say... We'll start here. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. I almost got it on the nose. And seven. Was this tree blocking it, really? Ooh. Popped me in the air a little bit. Whoop. Seven. Okay. And then we'll turn around do it the opposite direction. Uh, this isn't really centered up at all, but that's okay. Is this... Enough room for a merger. It is. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, and fall. Seven. Okay. This will be cake. <clears throat> okay, so now we're going to take our splitters and do them like this. Funny thing was, I probably could have just done a a, a uh, that's what I'm looking for. <clears throat> uh, uh, blueprint. That's the word. Blueprint. I could have done a blueprint. Okay.
you all the way. That one's off. I thought that might be off. But I have a lot. Yeah, I do. I got tons of this stuff now. Okay. Right. Bouncy, bouncy. <clears throat> and actually, we'll take you. Nope. Give me, there it is. And we'll say, like, so. Okay. Let's try to make this look a little bit prettier. There we go. And then... Uh, center, yeah. There. Alright. And that will distribute our silica perfecto oh, oh jesus okay <laughs> sorry i might be going to california pretty soon ooh All right. Um, so my, I'm planning my California trip. Maybe going to Disneyland, which could be fun. Okay, where can I get some power? How about you? You are full. Let's do it that way. Okay. Let's see, how do we want to do power for these guys? Do we just want to do each individual one? Let's turn it up. Yes, okay. There we go. Eh. I gotta settle these to silica, don't I? Okay. Alright, let's turn you into silica. Copy settings. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and last but not least, fourteen. And we only need a third of one of these guys. So let's just make this one. A third. Okay. Now let's power all of these monkeys. There. Yeah, it's on this side. Hopefully, you guys are digging the silica content happening tonight. Got to like, heck yeah, silica! Woo, yeah, buddy. I know people have been dying for the silica content. Keep getting asked, Jack, Jack, when's the silica content coming? And I'm like, 
just bear with me. All right, these are taking in... Tw oh, that one's taking in, like, nothing. They, these are taking in... Oh, 22.5 per minute, so just mark one belt. So there's plenty for them. Okay, and these should actually be kicking on, right? Yeah, okay, there they are. Moving. Okay. Let these things fill up. Who was that subscribing? That was Ford Lover 2009 for 23 months. Thank you very much, Ford Lover 2009. Appreciate you, buddy. That's it, very kind of you. <coughs> Voodoo, good evening, Jack Chat. How's everyone? I'm doing well. Doing well. Mr. Snaps, how you doing as well? See the way. I played this game once, it was just okay. <laughs> It was satisfactory, is what they're saying. Do you guys get it? Do you get the joke? That was a very funny joke. All right, so let's go ahead. I know this is dumb, but we're going to spit this out this direction. Right, which, which way do we want to spit this? Because I need... I need to ultimately send it over here to the train station. So... Maybe we'll send it back and around, like over this way. Maybe we go up and over this, and then like connect to here. Although this is going out. Instead of straight down. It's going up and over. So... Okay, okay. Let's figure this out. All right, so these are all cooking. These are all doing well. So let's go ahead. Let's send it the other way. Let's send it the other way just for ease of sake. Um, okay, what's the... Did I manage to get it exact? Did I make an even number of, of cuts here? So it's not not going to be centered up because either way it's so if I would have done them one like tick back it would have been perfect but alas that is not how it will be handled today all right so these I'm going to be spitting out 500 a minute 37.5 times 13 yeah so I'm going to I'm going to be doing 500 a minute which this belt can hold like 700 right 780. Yeah, so cool. Okay, these are all spitting out 37.5, so Mark 1's out. There should be plenty. Okay. And so now I need to figure out what to do with my belt. Okay, so that's facing this way, so that doesn't really work. But I could put it here. This have it coming straight down. All right. So this. Oh, nice, we already have these belts pretty much done, so this belt here. I need to go up to the top and fix that. Don't let me forget that I need to go to the top and fix that at the train station. Actually, we can torch this. Okay. So this was the old belt coming from over there. So that's pretty much gone. Now I can just...
Oh, I hit the floor instead of the, uh... I got it. Okay. And you. There we go. And that's pretty much all of it. <clears throat> okay. We'll torch this as well. What's going on here? Alright, so... Oh god, why is this crooked? We Let's fix that right now. Okay, let's figure out... So I could actually... Pretty much just drop it right on here. Is this going up? I can't tell. Is that is that even? Does that look? I think it's actually too low. I think it's one click too low. I think that's even lower. Yep. <laughs> All right. How's that look? That's too low. Oh man, okay, so it goes low. That's too low. Man, okay, okay we're just gonna do this. And then we'll burn this. So we'll use it, come on. Uh, well, is it just gonna snap? Don't snap, don't All right, that's our last try. Still too low. I don't care. Okay, that's close enough. No, it's not. What am I saying? Of course it's not. I gotta, I gotta do this right. Might as well do it correctly. The first time. A. Okay. And we need to. That's gross. All right. Let's 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 make these look pretty. What are we doing here? What are we even doing here, you guys? All right. Let's just bring it down next to this guy. that this thing will hug up against this and then we'll say you like water for elephants all right got that belt all squirreled away now so this is the <clears throat> second thing here this is my imports this is my export so it's going to be in this one actually comes from over here. Who is this? Who are you? Who are you? You are gain. Okay, edit your timetable. Time Exports. Okay, gain. I only want you to load uh, circuit boards and uh, no, uh, heavy modular frames save. Okay. Because so I don't want that to pick up the quartz in here, because that's just going to create a huge mess. 
Jack, any more thoughts on your TTC build? Ah, oh, Voodoo, yes, I want to do it. I want to do it. That is something for sure I want to do. I'm thinking once I... I'm not importing anything. Once I finish the... Um... <clears throat> That's what I'm looking for. <clears throat> once I finish kind of... Uh... My overall, like, well, okay, I think it's going to be like around my storage area. So it's going to be around my main base area. I don't know exactly how it'll work yet, but it's going to be over there. <clears throat> and that's the goal. So once we figure out exactly ooh, what's going on with that, then we will make it happen. The second time around. I wonder. I think this is too low or too high. It is okay. <clears throat> what we can do is go here, and we'll say, "How's that?" Look? That looks kind of cool. All right, I'll take that. Okay. All right, we just got to get our exports down to here. Which... Do like so. And we'll say... center of that. Put it here because we have the room for it. Put you there. Beauty. So there we go. We got silica theoretically pumping in at 500 a minute. Oh, perfect timing. Okay, let's see if let's see if this guy this guy should not pick up any of that silica from Crystal City. This is gain, so we should, so theoretically gain should not pick up silica. Gain should only pick up circuit boards and heavy modular frames. Okay, everything stopped. And we've got... Nope, it's picking up silica. Why are you picking up silica? I asked you specifically not to pick up silica. Why did you not save? All right, uh, we want circuit boards and heavy modular frames save. Yeah, load only, those two. From Oh, did I do it from main imports? No. Okay. Oh, I didn't hit save changes there. That's what happened. Okay. Well, let's go and see what happens. <laughs> Hey Jack, been watching you since 2013. Hope you're well. See if 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 I didn't understand what you meant by that, that could come across creepy. <laughs> I've been watching you for 10 years. <sighs> thank you very much. I do appreciate that HP man. That is very very kind. The color gecko prime warden. Thank you very much. Don't forget, if you have Amazon Prime, you get a free Prime subscription any streamer of your choice. If you want to choose me, that would be super awesome. But hey, you should use that Prime subscription because everyone forgets about it. I know I do. 
I used mine today, as a matter of fact. Actually, yesterday, as a matter of fact, uh, with my buddies over at Mega64. So, they were, uh, they were streaming the Nintendo Direct thing. I'm like, hey, you know what? I'm going to go give them some love. And so I subscribed. HP Man. Look at that. Boom. HP Man was like, oh, yeah. Amazon Prime is a thing. Thank you very much. Please, for the love of all things holy, adjust your autosave time. Is that a thing I can do? Let's see here. Options. Uh, gameplay. Autosave. Oh, every five. Yeah, let's do it every... How about every 15 minutes? Instead of every five. Thank you very much for that. Are there any games interested that are come? Any games you're interested in that are coming out this year? Uh, I don't know. I have a thought. Like, I mean, sure, I'm sure there are. But I'm so... Alright, cool. So that's all getting banked. So all the silica is just going to go ahead and get, get tanked. Because I don't have it set up yet to uh, go to anywhere. So, okay, that's cool. Alright, so that's working. So gain now should only... Be, uh... Oh, you know what? I need to add a buffer. I need to add a buffer for the train. So, what I'm going to do. Choo -choo. Uh, yeah, as far as games coming out this year, i sure. Like, nothing off the top of my head is like, oh my god, I can't wait that this is coming out. I'm sure something like that exists. I just cannot think of it for the life of me right now. Uh, IT Springlemeyer, happy one year of being a warden. Thank you very much for that. It's a really cool detective game Nintendo Direct announced. That's cool. So, we'll see. I don't know. I mean, again, like, nothing is like, oh my god, like, I'm, I'm having a blast playing Satisfactory right now, so... What was that weird line on the edge of the Who was that? Uncooked ravioli, six months. Thank you very much, uncooked ravioli, for the sub. I do appreciate you. All right, let's torch this. All right, so what we're going to do... We're going to come over here. We're going to add a buffer, like, right here. So what we're going to do, we're going to say... Organization, industrial storage. Oh, come on, is that? Okay, that's perfect. Put you about there. So what this means is, when the train, when the train stops, uh, the belt will stop. This will back up, and then this will just start filling up this right here. So it doesn't really need to be this big, but at some point, we're going to hit capacity of that guy, and this, this thing will fill up at least. So, there we go. Now, do I have... Do I have any trains that aren't doing anything? I wonder. Do I have enough for all that? I do. Cool. Okay. So, let's build us ourselves a new train line. Who is this? Squeak. Okay, cool. All right, we're going to say electric locomoto. You go there. And we're going to say two freight cars. One and two. Okay, so this guy here. This will be our quartz train. Let's make it... Let's make it just like... What, pink, I guess, is quartz? Save you. Save you. Select color, that. All right, so now this will be, <clears throat> this will be the Q train for quartz. It's the Q train, it's gonna show up here. It's gonna go to, this is Crystal City Exports. Crystal City Exports, it is gonna pick up silica and save that and then it is going to go all the way over to waterfall imports 
Where are my waterfall imports? And it's going to unload uh, silica. Let's save that. Did I say quartz or did I say... Okay, silica, good. Save changes. Turn on self-driving. Here we go. <clears throat> Let's do it. And I had to make it... Choo -choo. I had to make it the second. I had to make it two cars long because silica is in the second bucket there. And so while this is loading, you'll actually see right over here. Theoretically, boom. See how that stopped? But you can see behind it, the silica is still being produced and it's just going into that bucket right there. So basically that means we're not losing any silica because of loading. Beautiful. Look at it. It's loading up the silica train car. Perfect. Why don't I, yeah, this is not, not quartz. This would be the S train. So the silica train. Now, we need to figure out how much per minute the silica train actually does take in. <clears throat> because we need to hit that 500 a minute. We basically need to empty that guy. So we may have to run two or even three lines of S trains. So this will be S train one. <clears throat> because we need to spread them out where that thing is always getting empty because we need to be picking up 500 silica a minute, which means we need to get every single bit from that export. So <clears throat> in order to keep up the, uh, the actual amount. So we'll see if that happens. <coughs> uh, what do I see? Nipples of the North says, in your honest opinion, is this game worth it? Uh, for me, yes. 1,000%. This is a game that is 100% in my wheelhouse. I love this style of game. It is so much fun for me. It's like this thing was made for exactly the kind of stuff I wanted to do. And so for me, yes, yes, this is this game is perfect. Um, it's if you, this, it's like a building game. It's kind of like Minecraft in that you're building up stuff, but it's all automation. So it's, it's, it's called a factory game. Literally, it's called a factory game. So if you've ever heard of Factorio, it's similar. This is basically the the 3D version of Factorio, first person version of Factorio. So it's a lot of fun. I'm really, really digging it and I can't get enough. So, uh, I am also, this one save file, I am 196 hours into it. So, I, I'm, I'm pretty bought in at this point. Um, yeah. So, there you go. All right. Jack, looking to start a Minecraft server, any thoughts, opinions, advice, mods, and plugins? Man, Voodoo, find, I would play around with different mods you like, and then just find one that you dig and just go for it. I mean, if you're into Sky Factory or Stoneblock or something like that, try it, but... Or if you just want to do vanilla, go for it, man. Don't, don't, uh, don't limit yourself. All right, so here we go. We're going to drop off. This is Waterfall Imports, and we should drop off all of our silica right here. <clears throat> Which I don't think I have. Oh, crap. This is unload. Uh, well, too late. Yeah, so it's... I forgot to set these because I haven't touched them yet, so it's going to sit here for 15 seconds and be like, huh, that didn't work, and yeah, there it goes. All right, well, we know the line at least works. Okay. Beauty must. And so now, one and two. So this is where our silica will be coming down from and put you here there we are all right <clears throat> we'll get these going down feeding into a crate of some nature first Uh, 
that. All right, it's a little bit further down. Beautiful here and here, so. <clears throat> so let's see here, what can we do? Or should we do, a, you know, we can, we can do a line up there and move them all over that direction. <clears throat> Man, my throat, I apologize you guys, it sounds super gnarly. So we're going to say one, two. That's where we will leave it. There we are. And now we need to get up there. I don't think I can make it that high. Temporary. And go. There we go. So we will. We are. Yeah, I said it. We are. Live in Rock Nation. Uh, industrial store. Be too far away. And we'll say this. There. We'll fall off the side real quick. So, let's not, <sighs> all right, let's move you back. Oh, how long that thing is jutting. I don't think I've ever seen it go that far. All right, uh, we're going to say this guy will just move it back again. We'll put you like there. That works. Bonk. This guy. Close enough. <clears throat> all right, so that is going to be all of our silica. It gets dropped into this box. And then we can actually feed it over there and kind of along this back line. So, I do. Anything's going up through these guys right now. No, there's not. Okay. And do like so. All right. Because this is going, wait, that's going up, right? Correct? Yeah, these are going up. So is that, did I actually make it go up or down? There. The heck? Why aren't you connecting to that? Okay, that is right. Those are fine. Now then, I can actually run. Of course, that line is like perfectly in the way of this. It's great. Okay. Okay, we'll say four right in the middle.
Where do I put that one? Right here on the edge. So, oh, gross. Whatever. Okay. You know what? No, no, I don't want to do that. I don't, I don't want to have a butt out like that. Let's do it. That's better. All right, there we go. So that is now spitting out all of our silica into this hole. Reconnect these guys. All right, so that's all good now. So now we got silica dropping down here. Okay, so how do we want to send it over there? Do we just want to follow this line here? It's a little hitch. I love it. Oh, we can just... I guess this isn't... Oh, you know what? Crap. God, do I want to send everything? I might... <laughs> I might honestly make another train station, like, right there. Because this is spitting out... Coal. Why is coal... What, what? This doesn't need to spit out coal anywhere. <clears throat> Most of the coal's going that way. And then, really, I just need coal to fill up this thing. Because this is the... Caterium line, which Caterium is what makes uh, what does Caterium make? Caterium ingots. They're made of quick wire, right? Is that what it is? No hover pack yet. No, Ziost, Ziost, Ziost. I actually have a hover pack. I just don't have it equipped right now. Um, I, I'm just used to the flying pack thing, so I just use it more often. All right, Caterium is made for quick wire. This, I think, goes down to copper. Yeah. It's going down to my copper area, so I do need that. So I need that line. This coal, though, literally only is being used for this. So my exports could be Caterium, and then it could be Alclad sheeting, it could be casings, and then the nitrogen stuff, right? So I could just make those, my three exports all feed through there. So let's, so actually I didn't need to destroy, well. All right, so let's just, let's, let's we'll have to redo all this stuff anyway, so. All right, so this coal literally can just feed right into that guy. There's no point in it doing all this fancy stuff anymore. Right? So, but that's a problem to figure out once we get further along the line. Anyway, all right, so Caterium there, blah, blah, blah. So now, let's get our Silica to head back over towards our aluminum station. So, okay, so, and I can do this. That's in tier five, okay. There it goes. Now it's all going over there, tier five. Now we're spitting out all the coal. Now we're coal happy. 
Okay. <sighs> Silica, I gotta get it over here. Oh, wait. Oh, God, what did I do that for? That was silly of me. Undo. Dang it. Okay. Okay, there we go. That is correct. This coal is correct. Don't need that much, but that's okay. All right, how do we get silica over here? What's the best way? So silica needs to feed all the way down. What is that? Why is there a tower of... Okay, so silica needs to feed into these guys. Oh man, I wish I had a... Alright, so I've got it feeding into there. So if I, if I can merge it onto this belt... Okay, here it is. So this exports from here. Oh, this line is stupid and in the way. Yeah, I can do that and just not tell anyone what we've done. I wonder... What tier line is that? There we go. Clean. I'm assuming I didn't break everything with that. I hope. Okay, cool. So, if I can get silica... That's a merger, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. And then... Alright. So, this is all silica. Needs 125 a minute. 125 a minute is a logistics. So I'm going to be at least Mark three. Okay, so it looks like they are Mark three already. Oh, smart Jack. Jack, thank you so much. Previous Jack. That's ah, tier five. That's fine because this needs to spread. All right, so I need to get my silica feeding right into here. Okay, so what's going to be the best way to do that? I can do this outside lip here. Because this is pretty much... I do... I'm like here. I want to get to here. There. Of course, I have it going backwards. That's gross. So, we'll get you to like here. Let me back that up a little bit. I mean, it looks so good, I just have to back that thing up a little bit. I mean, you're fine, satisfactory builder. I just need to back that thing up. You can call me, you know, anything. Let's back that thing up. 
you want there or there? Alright, that's what we were going for. Yeah, okay, cool. Alright, and then here. And then, should we just go ahead... Hey Jack, what is the primary goal of this game? That is a fantastic question. The primary goal of this game is to drive myself wild. <laughs> it's, it's to uh, basically automate everything where you sit back and don't have to manually do anything. Um, that is the that is the ultimate goal of this game, in my opinion. Uh, yeah. I would say that's right. What do you guys think? Do you think that's that feels correct? That's coming down that line. So I need to be that on. So I need this. Whatever I end up. Ah! Ah, I did like an extra click right there at the top. So, I basically need a belt. So that's on this line. Right, right to there. I didn't hit that bike. Perfect. Did I? Did I accidentally just nail it? I think I did it. No, it's, it's a little high. Just a bit high. Where is it on the line? Okay, it's like dead center. It's, it's just going down. All right, so I don't know why I destroyed that. <laughs> okay. Is that it? There it is. Look at that clean line. Beautiful. All right. Anyway, what was I saying? I lost all train of thought. I got I got I got focused on all of this nonsense. I apologize again. Uh okay, and so what we'll do is 
we will set this up where we have a drop hole. Right here. Ah. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> you got to give me that. Okay. There's that. Oh my gosh, I'm getting raided. Shadow at noon. Thank you very, very much for that raid. I really do appreciate you guys. Check out Shadow at noon. Uh, thank you very much, everyone. Welcome. Hi, I'm Jack. I am currently playing Satisfactory. You might know me from other hits such as Achievement Hunter or Annual Pass or Rooster Teeth. I'm I've been at all of those things for a very long time and now I am oop, I am playing some satis oop, playing some satisfactory for you lovely lovely folks here on Twitch. So thanks for tuning in, thanks for joining me. Hopefully you want to hang around. I got a amazingly chill awesome community called the Wardens. I love them to death. They are the best. And uh yeah. So if you want to hang out, watch me play some satisfactory. I freaking love this game and I can't stop playing it. So I'm currently working on an aluminum factory that will produce aluminum at very high rates of speed. Oh, I should probably finish the line here, huh? Uh, and yeah, okay, so that's, there we go. That's all good. That's that there. That just feeds into that thing. Okay, cool. And uh, anyway, I've been playing this this one save file for almost 200 hours. And I'm still nowhere near complete. All right, let's see, see if this works. Look at all that silica go. It's flowing in. Look at it splitting out like crazy. And these things should start kicking on at a pretty good rate. Wow, that looks good. That looks real good, as a matter of fact. Beautiful. So these are going to start filling up here. These take a whole lot of silica per minute. So these take 125 times 6. So we're looking at 700 sil 750 silica a minute. And my belt can push 780. So hypothetically, they're all going. And right now they're all spitting out aluminum, which is great. It's just going into a uh, an awesome sink right now, which is okay. Oh, this takes in... These all take in one. Okay, yeah, that's right. I right. made them all go up. So it's just eating all the aluminum, which is fine for now. Um, because I'm going to now take all of this aluminum being produced and make stuff out of it. So some of it's going to produce uh, owlclad sheeting. Some of it is going to produce um, casings. Some of it will produce nitrogen containers so so much smog being produced it's okay it's all it's all fake it's all fake it's not real you know we don't want to produce real stuff okay first of all all clad sheeting i don't know okay empty fluid tank that's easy we can make these how much does that make per minute 60 per minute so 60 in 60 out so we can do that no problem um oh god you know all clad sheeting i think is requires something else too doesn't it is it an assembler that makes this? Cheap silica. Parts and stone. How much does that make? 20 something. Okay. There it is. Okay. So I need copper. 30 aluminum, 10 copper. Makes 30 alclad sheets. So. I need to bring in copper from my copper factory. That's why we got it. Oh, what, okay, what am I doing? So let's do... Let's throw a constructor down, and we'll throw an assembler down. So let's look at some rates here. So... Ooh. All clad casing. Holy crap. So 150 per minute. 75 per minute of that. Okay. Keep that in mind. I wonder if I, if I slow this down. What is... How do I make this... 
How do I make that 100 per minute? I reduce it by a third. So that takes in 100 and 50 copper ingots produces 75 a minute. So 50 copper ingots. Keep that in mind. 50 copper ingots. That's not a bad idea. And then this... All right, 50 copper ingots for that. And then 10 per here. So, really, I mean, I guess I can just have too much copper. I'm fine with that. Okay. 10 copper per minute. I'm producing... 600 copper per minute, right? Or aluminum per minute. Yeah. What is leading into that? Are these all going? I feel like this isn't actually making anything. Oh, because it's full of water. Oh, you know what? That Was that to limit the water? There's too much water. How is there too much water? Okay, so this water is full. If I if I do You know what? I'm going to do I'm going to flush the whole pipe in. Oh god, did that do everything? Did I do all of it. Did that flush this too. Oh, I did. Oops. Okay, that was a mistake. <laughs> Cuz this is all interconnected. Oops. Okay. Well, interesting. We'll see how this goes. Uh yeah, that was that was dumb of me. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn all these on standby for now, just to fill this thing up with water again. Okay. All right. Oops. That was that was dumb. Jack always forgets he has a notepad on screen. I I know. I got it here. That I, I you know got to use it more often. All right, water is filling up these guys right now. That's good. This, I limit. This, I don't limit. This, I want a, a full flow rate. So this is getting up there. Or well, something has ate a whole bunch of it. Because this, yeah, so it's not going past here. So this is water that's coming in from the excess of those guys down there. Well, let's, let's turn them back on and see what happens. Oh, oh, wow. Okay, so it is filling up now. I assumed on standby they would go, but I guess not. Okay. Okay, these are all going now. Water, plenty of water here. Oh, you know what I wanted to do? Maybe, maybe that's what it was. Maybe. Okay, that's good. That's good. All right, there we go. Now it's now it's draining water. Now it's not full of water. It was getting stuck full of water. Watching this coal go down. This should not be getting lower and lower. It's like not getting enough coal now. You know, it was part of the deal why I slowed this down so it doesn't. Yeah, I think. I think I did that so this gets more coal than this. Okay. So I've got 600 lumina ingots a minute. How do I want to divide these things up? So, what do we need most of? Um, so let's do, how many of these casings? So this is three ingots get 60 out. So 90 in get 60 out. 
How many casings do you think we need? OSU Blazer, two months in a row. Thank you very much, OSU Blazer. Appreciate you, buddy. Oh. Because I don't know how much casing I'm going to need. All of them. Nice. Okay. Let's try to keep it somewhat even. Although, all clad aluminum sheets, I want a lot of. Oh, not casing. This is this one we wanted to make. Or these things. So that's 60 in, 60 out of the fluid tanks. And the fluid tanks are for nitrogen, packaged nitrogen gas. Four of those plus one. So 240 a minute. Does anyone remember how much nitrogen I'm pulling from my tanks? Over there somewhere. Does anyone remember <laughs> how much this pulls? Seven pure nodes of nitrogen gets me what exactly? <laughs> uh, is it 900 a minute cell? Is it actually 900 a minute, or are you just guessing? Are you just looking around the rooms and saying, looking around the room and saying you're loving things, or is it you love things? Belt cap at 780. True, but I can pump these into tanks. I mean, I guess I could do 600. Because yeah, yeah. So the. Th uh, Okay, let's... 1, 600, 1, 300. Okay, thank you. I thought that was the case. Okay, 600 and 300 a minute. 600, 300 minutes. And they take... Alright, so 240 a minute. So 600, so 600... Uh, I can bump that up to 300, 300... Alright, let's just real quick. Okay. Wait a minute. What what is What do I need to make what do I need to build? Is it a blender? Oh, I think it is a blender, is what I need. Packager, okay. I can make one of these. Alright. Whoa. Unpackage oil. Unpackage turbo fuel. Alright, so package nitrogen gas. This takes in 240 a minute. And gives me 60. So that's a quarter. So four to one. So if I'm if I'm making 900 a minute divided by four, so 225. So I would need 225 empty fluid tanks a minute. 225. These make 60 per minute. So basically I need 225 ingots per minute to match that. So 225. Okay, let's do this. So 25 minute for uh, uh, nitrogen packages. So that is, that leaves me with 600 minus that, so it'd be 375 left. So 375 remaining. Oh, come on. Just, why does it not auto save? Okay, what did I say? 375 remain, 225 for nitrogen canisters. Right? Is that what it was? Is that what we said? So 225. Yeah, okay. So 375 remain for that. So of that 375, we can use... So these are one-to-one -one for, uh, for sheets. And these are 100 
gets me 75. So these are three to four, or four to three. Canisters are reused. Oh, that's true. I mean, I guess I could use them and return them. Well, we can always, we can, we can readjust down here. But for now, I'll package these guys up. And then figure out if we do get some kind of reusing thing back up top, we can do that. So, for now, let's just make those. And we'll sort it from there. All right. So. Uh... Aluminum casings. I don't know. I mean, alclad sheeting is great. I think this is probably what we need more of, but... 200... No, you need 175. 175. So once I basically get 175 per minute. And then over here, if I did this, I did 200. I'd be getting 150 of these per minute. I don't even know. What do I need aluminum casings for? What are aluminum casings for? What do they go into? Why do I need them? <laughs> I'm sure I'll need them somewhere. I'm sure I need them in all of this crap up here, don't I? Blazem Dream. Thank you very much. Brand new warden right there. Thank you very much, Blazem Dream. Only one constructor for casings is fine. Cell, I love you. Thank you very much. All right, so we'll do a hundred. We'll do a hundred fifty for casings, and that leaves us with two twenty-five remaining, which we can do. So this will be. Uh, I didn't. Messed it up again. So we'll say 150 for uh, aluminum casing. So which will be one assembler? Is that what this is? Yeah, okay. One assembler for that. For the nitrous and canisters, 225. Which is these guys. So we'll do four of these and just overclock one of them. So, four constructors. Constructors. And that leaves me, so 225, 150, that is 375. So, 375 says 225 remaining. For alclad sheeting. 225, alclad sheeting. Which is how many assemblers? Uh, so 225 divided by 30, seven and a half. Uh, so we'll just do eight assemblers. So eight x assembler. Okay. So 225 of that. So 225 times. Uh, so 225 and then a third of 225 is 75. So I need 75 copper here. So, uh, I'll clad that's 75 copper. And then for these guys, I'm doing one. So just bump that back up to 100. We need 75 copper here as well. And so for casing, 75 copper. So just 150 copper needs to end up over here. So I need 150 copper in. Uh, man, I wish there was... I wish there was a copper line somewhere not terribly far. There's... Copper right there, which I've tagged for this guy. That guy right there. I almost wonder if it's worth it just to make a truck station. 
Like literally just truck this down along the side and just right over to here. Or, I mean, I've got my copper mine here, like right here, which I'm getting a ton of copper ore out of. Like I've got one, where is it? I've got one pure copper node right here pumping out like 600 a minute. It's, it's wild. It's actually closer to here, or to here. All right, I guess they're about equidistant. Frustrating. All right, we'll, we'll just pull it from here for now. Um, okay. Why are we, why are we stopped? What is going on here? Why, why are we stopped? I'm not getting any more scrap. So what is going on? Why, why do we have no scrap? This is full of water. All right, so this is spitting out 100 water a minute, 100 water a minute. So these are all full of water. So that's 300 water a minute. This is all filling this guy. So 300 water a minute goes this way, gets behind this. I don't think that would matter. And it's getting stuck here because the Illumina solution is stuck. So the Illumina solution is full of the egg. Okay, so that's backed up because of the water. So why is this? That water should be feeding, like, I need 900 water total. Is it re because you removed a piece? No, I, I replaced it. I just moved it down. So, yeah, this valve. So this is a little solution. It's, pu it's pushing this way. So there we go. So this should have a flow rate of 600 a minute, right? Yeah, that's correct. Or roughly. Because all of this luminous solution is coming out of here. Oh, wait a minute. It's producing 120 a minute? 120, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so it's 5. So that's 600. So it's making 600. Illumina solutions being produced. It's going into here. That 600 Illumina solution is being fed. 200. Oh, wait a minute. I have it reduced. So this takes 200 a minute. 200 and 200. So it takes 600 a minute. So those are all good. They are producing 100 per minute of water. Right? That's 300 water. 300 water per minute comes over here, adds to the 600 water a minute I'm pulling here. Right? need that okay so this so I'm pulling 120 per minute of water times five which is 600 so 600 plus 300 is 900 water per minute which is what I need that, that's how much water I need wait 180 180, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 180 times 5. 900 water a minute. 
I don't know why I'm stuck. Like, what, what, what am I getting trapped with here? Pipes can only carry 600. Uh, Ardwolf, yes, yeah, I agree, yes. But what's happening is, Ardwolf, is 600 is coming this way in this one pipe. So this 600 goes into here and starts feeding these right here. So 600 gets knocked down to like 400 to 200, and then it's theoretically all gone-ish over here. And then I've got another 300 from this end. So this is never more than 600. Just reduce the pumps a bit to account for slop. Fuck it. All right. Let's. All right. We'll reduce one of them down and then flush the pipes again. All right, so this guy is pumping out 120. So let's do this like 120 per, or just 100 per minute. So that's going to reduce it down a bit. And we'll just do, you know what? Let's flush the whole dang thing. Okay. The problem is the pumps keep going even if machines stop for a second. Once they stop for any reason, the pipes get full and overload the system. But I, the, the pump should not be ever getting too, like, nothing should ever, you know what, let me pull some stuff, I wonder if the silica backup did it, no, I can't imagine that would do it, because, I mean, they were, st they weren't stuck with, they weren't full of silica, these were full with water, is where they were getting trapped, So what I'll do, I'm going to make this like 580 here. I think that may, well, we'll, we'll see how it works. We'll see if it does actually go. Oh, all right. Problem is the pumps keep going. Machine train reason. Bucket. That was one of my favorite Kevin moments. That and when he threw a grenade against the wall, blew himself, and killed Jack with hilarity. God, that that moment genuinely might be one of the funniest things I've ever seen in my life. Like that was that legit broke me for a while. All right, so aluminum scrap is good. We're not backed up on aluminum scrap. That's coming out of here. Aluminum solution. Oh, you know what? We may have needed to... We may have been backed up on a Luma solution. So we may have actually wanted to, like, empty one of these guys out. When we had the chance. I think now it seems to be going. We reduced the water a little bit, so theoretically... So this is full. That's almost full. So now it's full of water again. So I guess that one's full of water, which means these are filling up. But I'm, I almost wonder if I need to, instead of, instead of, I guess what doesn't matter. I will keep an eye on it and see, see if this fixes itself. Theoretically, it should be okay. See, that's full of water here. See, this is... That's good, though. It's filling up very quickly. Okay. Oh, well. We'll, we'll deal with that later. All right. So now... Let's start setting up our next line. I almost wonder if I should... Should... I'll ask you guys. Should we move the aluminum... In one line, yes, we should. We should move the aluminum in one line over towards our train station over there. And then maybe underneath it, that will be where our our things are to convert stuff over. Instead of pushing all of it, like pushing copper all the way over here and then pushing four thing, or three things that way. So let's do one line that direction 
of all of my aluminum ingots. Sound like a plan? Or do I do a truck station? We do a truck station. <laughs> should we do a truck station? You guys, you guys want to? Should we do a truck station instead of a, a, a line? Because we have. This guy here already. Oh my god. Okay, so we would need to. This so the Caterium is going to our AC or whatever base. Truck it. Yeah, so we need We're gonna need to uh A pull two lines out of here because it needs to go fast. Uh feed it into maybe a storage container. Then divide that storage container into uh, Caterium for one. Oh, we need smart splitters. One splitting off Caterium, one splitting off uh, aluminum sheets. Okay. All right. I think we can do this. All right. So let's go ahead. a good height. Okay. So we're up above the truck station. And beneath the train. So Caterium is this first one, so we need Caterium lines going to here, so that's fine. Okay, so let's go ahead. Okay, so half of that thing. Oh, a little little close. A little closer for comfort. Let's back this guy up. Okay. Okay, so you will deal with that one here in a minute. Okay, we want to put these into a storage container as a buffer. Industrial storage. Okay, so everything from the truck station will quickly feed into this guy. Then we need to smart split out these guys. Oh, beautiful, I have two. That's exactly what I needed for now. All right, you. And then you. All right, so we'll say right will be Caterium or oh, and left will be aluminum ingot uh, center nothing copy that paste that beautiful all right and then yep that's exactly what I wanted to do all right now There. there. Actually, you know what? Let's let's reverse these. And so that way, Caterium can just pop right into that guy. Okay. 
cool. Okay. So now we will come over here. We're actually going to torch these two. Do one there. And one there. And... Now let's do it. Let's do it as a straight line. Oh, off, off by one. Okay. And now we will do. Stackable conveyor poles. So there. Yeah. Like so. So that will get Architerium going up. We should have an overflow. We should literally have an overflow both ways, as a matter of fact. of that okay and now overflow we'll go into here there we go so overflow is going to feed into that which will then feed into this guy okay that worked out pretty well hey simrel what's up how are you doing hope you're doing well thank you for asking how i'm doing i'm doing okay things have been a bit chaotic but i'm hanging in there Hope you're having yourself a lovely, lovely day. Okay. So we got that going now. So now we have an overflow. And that actually, like, hugs it perfectly. That looks beautiful. That is unintentional prettiness is what that is. OSU Blazer. Hey, Jack, I haven't actually gotten to watch this game yet. How is it? I I mean, me personally, I love this game. I love this game. It's incredible. I uh, can't get enough of it. I really, really enjoy it a whole lot. So that's my take on it. Um, you know, everyone's different. Good working on costumes. Sorry about the chaos, but fingers crossed it calms down for you soon. Thank you very much. Appreciate you, Simrel. Oh, man. But, uh, but yeah, so this game, it's like right in my wheelhouse it's it's chill it's calm it's relaxing i enjoy it a lot and uh yeah it's like it's made for me so do we have enough we need to make nine assemblers and four constructors do i have enough for all that i do beautiful all right let's start with our so uh Reinforced iron plate, cable, or rotor. Okay, our constructors. The four constructors to make. Let's get our all clad sheeting going first. That's eight assemblers. And again, we're going to need copper coming down from here. So we should probably make this. Oh, crap. Did I? 
Did I do that in such a way I'm gonna block the other the other holes coming down? Like, because this is out. Is that getting stopped? Ooh -hoo -hoo. Pretty close. Pretty, pretty close. Right there is what that is. Also, that is full of silica. Man, I should I should have turned this where when they come out they go this direction. That was silly of me. I wonder if I can fix that. Okay, let's see if. Come on, Jack. What are you doing? What is that? I don't understand why that was showing that it was actually... Anyway, whatever. That's feeding that way now. Then we'll just... That has so much silica in it. <laughs> so much silica. I'm getting so much silica. I'm getting way more silica than I need. I think. I've... Look, I don't, I don't want to put a sink up here. Yeah, I don't want to put a sink up here because the train will just not drop off silica if I don't need it. So that's fine. Okay, but this, the whole point of this was so I could get my copper. All right, this is the first car. Yeah, it's the first car. So if I get... Closer over here. I guess I can't really do that here. Okay. Right. There's that guy, and I won't be able. Wait, what? Why are you full of silica? What the heck? Wait, what? What is what? Why is it, huh? Well, that's not right. <laughs> okay, whatever. I guess it's just close enough where it's falling out of it. Magical connection. Jack out of curiosity, who gets all the swag earned from Extra Life? Like the t-shirt and the medal and such. Topher Twice, thank you. Uh, oh, Topher Twice was asking that. Thank you very much, uh, Mylia, for uh, sharing that. Appreciate you. Honestly, uh, that stuff is tagged to me. <laughs> so, it, like, that stuff, well, it goes, it goes to the office, but it has my name on it. But, I mean, technically it's Rooster Teeth. But um, no one person in particular gets the... Uh, you know, like, gets the medal and takes it home or anything like that, so, uh, but yeah, that's, ends up, ends up with me, and then, you know, and then I just, you know, destroy it all, <laughs> not really, not at all, um, yeah, okay, so copper, we're gonna have copper feeding down when it's all said and done. Copper is going to feed into this hole here. It's going to spit out silica for now, but that's okay. So, we all have copper. Oh, 
Okay, so I need to make it like on the line, basically. And it's the op just the edge of here. Like that. Okay, so this will be copper. I thought there was... Oh, I, I got it out of there. Okay, so this is going to be copper. Cool. So copper will be coming into that those boxes. And now, we've got a whole bunch of various things. So, technically, if I do this right, we can just manifold all of these various things. Right? Do I have blueprints for assemblers? Oh, I have three assemblers. Or stairs, tracks. What does that look like? Almost. So that has that split up into three. Okay, assemblers. I need nine assemblers. And those are the ones taking in the copper as well. And then four constructors. What is that little rock there poking out? Can I can I destroy you? Nope. Okay. I'll deal with that. Alright. So let's just do this. Let's let's line up nine assemblers. How wide are these things? Just a little bit longer. So we can do five and four evenly split. So we'll say back it up right to that. Oh, you know what? We need the. Well, that'll be a sushi belt if I do it that way. Yeah, it's more important to get them, get all the stuff coming on the inside. Okay, so we'll do. The outputs later. All right. All right. So one, two, three, four. Come on, give me that. That looks like it's... No, I guess all right. Okay. So those are all good. So now, if we put a splitter, what happened here? They were all... So they're all... Two... We'll just ignore that. No one, no one has to look at that. Okay, and so now we're gonna put a splitter. Let's say here, because I think oh, that is way too close. All right, so we need to go over like two more. how that looks. Alright, we need to go to the right one. <laughs> there it is. That looks good. So now... One... Two, okay, so... One, two, three, four. Basically kissed it in four. So one, two, three, four. So 
I do this... Okay, so now... Alright. Oh, nailed it. Gorgeous. Alright, now we need four of these guys. One, two, three, and four. Okay. Ooh, that's pretty tight. Pretty, pretty, pretty tight. Right here. This guy may have to move a little bit for my overflow, but that's okay. We'll deal with it later. Hey, baby roof. How you doing? I hate it when everything is uniform, and then I find one thing that's just a little different than everything else. Yeah, Mylia, that's 100% my, uh, my struggle. <laughs> cool. Well, these look beautiful. I'm happy with this. All right, so now... So that goes all the way down here. And then... Beautiful. All right, so let's go ahead start figuring out these guys. So, eight assemblers are going to be all clad sheeting. So let's make all clad aluminum sheeting. Three and four, five, six. Seven and eight. Perfect. These take in 30 per minute and 10 per minute. So these can be normal belts. these all off. Oh, that one's good. Okay. It's just this one. I thought that was about to be my nightmare. Okay. Perfect. And there we go. Okay, well, that's copper. I could literally... Uh, I could just feed straight into this guy. Watch this. Just watch me. Bit off. It's too low. Always misjudge the height of these guys. Now it's too high. All right, that's where the bottom needs to be. Right there. There it is. Okay, so this is going to be our copper. We'll be feeding down straight into these guys.
Okay, copper, copper, copper. Beautiful. So now... Nope. And don't forget, we still have to set up the truck station too, so that'll be a thing. This... is our... going to be our aluminum. Actually... This one is, this one is going to be our all clad casings, our alternate for that. Perfect. Just the single out of here, so that's cool. So I can run this one off by itself and merge the rest. So I don't have to worry about a sushi belt here. Cool. And actually... Half slab? Is that a thing? Oh, there is. Are these one or twos? These are ones. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's perfect. Okay. This is going to be cutting it close. think this will give it to me? How much am I making? 30 per minute? Oh, I think it just barely squeezes in there. It, it is very gross, but I think it works. I kind of hate it. There we go. So we got a belt connecting all those. I'm shocked that worked. Okay. And then you come on down here. You know what? I'm just going to put that like right there. Um, well, you know what, actually, so that's Caterium, this is coal, for whatever reason, I don't, I genuinely don't think, I don't know what is taking coal from this station, I don't think anything is. I don't know that anyone grabs coal from this station and does anything with it. If that's the case, I'm going to torch that. Oh, unless it's the the stupid ACU thing. Is it this one? Yeah, it is. Okay. That was your test aluminum factory? Is that what's taking it? Or is it... Okay, I think it might be... I genuinely think it might be my my um, ACU train. Is it Reamer? Is Reamer the one who goes up there? Waterfall exports. Because the ACU imports takes plastic, coal... And plastic, coal, and caterium. I think maybe coal was coming from here. Who goes up there? Ellie? Ellie, are you the one? All right, ACU imports. 
So she goes from aluminum exports. Yeah, she's taking coal. That's where the coal is coming from. So I do need coal. Ah, oh, that sucks, though. Did she get Caterium and coal from somewhere else? I mean, I guess I could... Voodoo, good morning from Sweden. A few unrelated questions. When did you realize that Couch 5K... Uh, when did you realize Couch 5K was starting to work? And now that you are a few marathons in, how do you set your goals? Faster times just completing them. Thanks for all you do with Extra Life and Rooster Teeth. Uh, that's from Smoking Onion. Thank you, uh, Voodoo, for, for sharing that. Uh, Smoking Onion, thank you. Uh, couch to 5K. I, I love Couch 5K a lot, which um, i got to figure out this coal situation. Uh, I, I love Couch to 5K a whole lot. It's, it's something that worked really, really well for me because you start very, very slow and work your way into it. Um, personally, uh, as far as the marathon stuff goes, um, I, yeah, you're right. I am kind of at a point now where I feel like I've sort of, you know, I've done all my goals. I, I did the, the, the dopey challenge, which is 48 miles in four days. Um, but now like, I just want to, I want to keep it up and get to the point where I feel more comfortable doing it. So, um, yeah, that, that's the goal is where basically like, I feel I, I, like I feel like I can do it easier. Not necessarily faster, but I mean, just like, like more comfortable. Uh, cause even now, like man, finishing that marathon was tough. It was very difficult and I was gassed by the end of it. I would love to get to a point where I can actually just be like, okay, I feel good. I feel happy with how I did. Oh, the station backed up again. The, the silica is backed up, which means the aluminum is backed up. I really need to figure out what's going on with that. Um, so... All right. Well, yeah, I mean, so my goal now is really just to, like, feel stronger, I guess I should say. So my water is getting backed up here. This valve, I ha okay, the limit is 300 because it's... So that, that would be all the water would feed out through here. If I do that... To pull the water out of those guys. I still just don't understand why. Well, let's, re let's reduce this down even more. So let's say like 550. So you're not going to get any more than that. So there's 600 coming out of that pipe. I still just don't understand why the water, why I'm getting too much water. Silica is not backed up. Coal doesn't matter. I guess producing alumina. We have too much alumina solution. Let's do that. Let's just drain this whole alumina section. Drain all there. So there should be no more alumina in there. Okay, so these are so alumina is not getting backed up at all. That's good. Anyway, on aluminum, aren't you getting water out of one of the steps and recirculating it back in the supply? Winter mute, I am. And I'm just confused because I'm I'm over full of water. Even though I'm literally only like these need uh I need nine hundred water total. And I'm producing nine hundred water. And somehow I'm overfilling with water. And I don't know why that is the case. I just, I genuinely don't know why that is the case. Why I'm getting backed up. Like, 200 per minute of aluminum solution. Am 
Why is that one? Why is this one filling up faster than the rest? I guess it's hitting the end and stopping. So this is, you can see it, it's like, this is running at 100% efficiency. Why does it only say it's 40% efficiency? I guess it's going up. Yeah, so that's running at 100% efficiency. This is running... It's actually going down. I'm actually not getting enough aluminum solution out of this guy. getting 600 a minute, okay. Well, rate's 200 a minute, that's correct. I should be getting, I don't know how I'm getting 201, because this can only take 200 a minute, so. Whatevs. Okay, well, we've reduced the amount of water it's taking in, so. Hypothetically, you've actually, like, made this not efficient anymore. I just don't know why. Water water eludes me, you guys. I just don't understand it. Water, water, dirt, as they say. <sighs> okay, let's figure out a line for all of this stuff. Anyway, I don't know if I... If I I properly answered the question of like how to like all the running stuff like um I like couch to 5k because I could feel myself doing better I could feel myself getting like it was becoming easier and easier and I could run for further and further and so I like that a lot I like that aspect of it um that just worked for me it doesn't work for everybody it worked for me though um it is tough if you're doing couch to 5k, you're gonna hit a point where uh, you hit, I wanna say like your first 10 minute run and oof, that is a, uh, that's a tricky one. Like you hit that first 10 minute run and you're like, oh my God, this is, I don't know if I can do this. But once you hit 10 minutes and then it's like, okay, you get used to that and then you do a 15 and then you do your first 20. And once you do like 20, you're pretty much set. So anyway, uh, yeah, another one, okay. I have the same problem. I ended up putting a side tank as a reservoir because the water doesn't always flow evenly. That's maybe that's not a bad idea. Maybe having like like flowing, but even that, I don't know. I mean, I guess if it's just kind of a buffer, but it's really not really a buffer. I okay. Like I could throw a, I mean, I could throw like a water tank somewhere in here. Well, I guess I couldn't there because the the coal. But anyway, um. All right, I'm glad I did this. I did this smart like. Okay, I'm gonna do this. To like this, I'll fix these and start pumping it the other way. Okay, so let's get this one. This isn't the direction I want the things to go. I want them going away from these, not towards them. Silly. Oh, not what I want to do. All right. Uh, wait, I just reposted it, so not beating your own time. Oh, wait, sorry, sorry. Okay. One more follow-up, says Smoking In. I just repost it, so not beating your own times. Uh, 
Are you talking about like my 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 runs, like my marathon runs? Yeah, I mean honestly, like my times, I I like especially the the, the marathons I've done, they're all Disney marathons. So like I just enjoy uh, the run. Like I enjoy getting the chance to you know run in the park, have a, have a lovely time. So I'm not too focused on like beating certain times. That's not that's not a huge thing for me. Um, I know some people are, but that's it's just not my thing. I'm like, eh, whatever. You know, if if I get a good time, fantastic. But I'm not, I'm not doing it to try to like be the fastest person ever. You know, it's nice when it's like, oh, okay, that was I did quicker. I'm out of concrete, really. Wow. Okay. I can't go down, can I? Oh, yeah, I can. Cool. Uh, yeah. So it's not as big of a deal for me. I, I mean, maybe in the past that would have been something I would have. You know, pushed myself like, oh, I've got to, got to be faster, I got to be stronger, blah blah blah. But it's like, nah, it's not really my, my, my goal anymore. That's just not, not nearly as important as it may have once been. Okay, so I need to get. Oh, what was I doing? I'm, what am, I'm not doing a, a line here. I'm a dum dum. I'm doing a truck station. Yeah, yeah, that's the ticket. Silly Jack. Tricks are for kids. And the cool thing is I have coal already feeding into that truck station over there, so I don't need to worry about that. So this is all stupid. Okay, so... Of course, that does mean I need a lot of concrete. amount of concrete should be okay. I wonder if I have enough to make a truck station. Oh, since water is recirculating and fresh water added, if anything, it slows its use down. Output's being full. The pipe thing gets over full and backs up. Thank you, Mylia, and thank you, Blazem Dream. Well, I've now reduced my input to 550. So through this, it's only going up to 550. So... Theoretically, I'm not getting as much water, and that will maybe be better. I mean, so far, it doesn't seem to be backing up. Let's take a look at these guys. These are the ones producing water. Yeah, so these are these are now emptying out. So that's good. That's a good sign. So I think, theoretically, now that these are emptying out, I can slowly start easing that line back up. But I won't mess with it for now because this does seem to be going pretty efficient. We're at 97% efficiency right now. So I think that may have tricked it. That may have done it by reducing this line down. So that's good. I'm getting my water. Water now I need dirt. That is true. I do need my dirt. <laughs> All right. Trucks. Transport. Truck station. Oh, look at that. I've got enough for it. Okay. So. Uh, let's... How big? How big is this truck station? I always forget. Okay. Not terribly big. Put on that line there. do like so well, let's go ahead and just do this side too just to make it like that and this will be load all right This will then feed into 
gear. When it's all done. Okay, that's that. Now, we need a truck. Do I have... Gorgeous? Beautiful. You're a monster. Look at you. Alright, I'm just gonna put that in there for now to fuel it. And we're gonna say record menu. Start recording. Close that menu. And then we'll say F to load truck. Make that to go away. Then we'll go Drive down here. Jump that. Looking solid. Feeling good. We're gonna take the long way around this guy. And then go up here. Gonna say F unload. And wait for that. Then we'll go back down. Run over the bird. Then we just crank it down this way. So, we trip that guy. All right, now we're going to open record menu. Oh, wait, hang on. Save path. It's going to be uh, loading aluminum. Save it. And now we will say. Enable autopilot. And I will get out. Okay, come over here. I need to set it up to uh, just take uh, coal as opposed to my. Post the gas I put in it. So where's the truck? Oh, there it is. Okay. Let's also let's make it pink. Why not? Okay, you're gonna stop. Perfect. And we'll put our coal into you. Beautiful. All right, so that means aluminum is... Oh, hey, buddy. That means aluminum is now going to start popping up here. And it's going to start feeding up that away. Once we get it all said and done, we will fix this as well. Okay. Great. All right. So now uh, we've got copper theoretically feeding down from here. Oh, yeah. Did this finish taking all the silica? So this is all the silica. So now, uh, this is where the silica will go. Put it right on the line. Okay. 
What the? What line did you tell me to go to? So that is now Silica going going straight into the stuff. Okay. And this is going to be my copper. But no, we don't want it to go that way. anything in it okay so copper is going to be the first car we pull from let's go ahead and do this okay so copper's pulling in from there then going down then copper goes straight from there into these belts. Cool. Uh, since you didn't name any of the trains this, I pro proposed Warden Wagon for the truck's name. Uh, yeah, Mylia, that's a beautiful, beautiful name. I don't know if you can name trucks. I made it pink, though. <laughs> so that's something, right? All right, so that is all of that. And so let's now, we need four constructors. So we will have... So this is going to be copper coming over this way, or uh, whatever, coming over this way. And we're going to say production constructors, just four of these guys. So we'll just put four of them. These drive me nuts because they don't actually... You know what? No, I'll do it this way. Yeah, okay. Oh, that's... I'm a dum-dum. I'm a dum-dum. Why'd I do it so close? Why'd I do it so close? Tell me that. You know what we can do? Let's flip it. And we'll do our sushi belt. Two. I, oh, God. These aren't going to match at all. All right. Constructor. I do four of them. Two, three. Eh. You know what? Actually, uh, no, I'm not gonna do a sushi belt. I'm not gonna do a sushi belt because I can I can split all these things up pretty evenly. Okay. I'll just push it further back. I'll just push it further away. So if you're wondering what a sushi belt is, a sushi belt is a belt that it contains multiple items like so it's not all just the one thing so you might have like steel plates wire every like copper like all in the same line so they call it a sushi belt because like a sushi restaurant will do that where it'll have like you know everything all kind of feeding the same direction at once i'm assuming that's for the name of what comes from Okay. Okay, so these four are all, all clad aluminum sheeting. Hmm. Jack, are you play are you gonna play Minecraft with Strict again? Man, uh Ash or as Heggy, I'm not sure I'm assuming Ash Eggy. Uh, I would love to. Strict is kind of, he's sort of moved on past gaming stuff. Uh, I've actually talked to him not terribly long ago. And uh, he's doing well. But, uh, he's, you know, he, he kind of, he had his time with uh, with the video game stuff. He enjoyed it. But I think he's uh, kind of moving on a little bit. So, 
but super great dude. I'd love to do more stuff with him in the future, though. Like, his his work, like, he's such a nice guy. He's genuinely, like, a really, really nice dude. And uh, I really enjoyed working with him. So, I would be 100% down to do more stuff with him someday in the future. How? How? How do I always do this? I always get one of, like, all of them are great except for the one. And the one is just messed up. Drives me bonkers. Okay. Of course, it has to do a little hiccup here, huh? You know what? We can push all this back. Do it like so. go. Alright, so this is all feeding in aluminum, and we're gonna make was this just empty fluid tanks? Is that the idea for this one? Nitrogen canisters, make four constructors for that. And we're doing 225 nitrogen canisters, so... I've got... Two, uh, 120, 240. So 240. We wanted to get down to 25, so subtract 15, so 45. So that'll take in 45 a minute there. So 45, so 60, 120, 180 plus 45 is 225. And so that will reduce that down. So that should be good. And we wanted 225 all clad sheetings which this is 30 times 8, which is 240, right? 30 times 8. 240, we get, so we need to subtract 15 from one of them, so we'll make these 15 per minute. And that will reduce that down. And then 150 aluminum casing, which was one assembler, which is, I believe, this guy. This is aluminum casing, all right at 150. So there we go. So we've got our hypothetical 600 aluminum ingots a minute happening here right now. Two things can be marked off your notepad now. And I guess really most of this can be marked off my notepad, right? Those, yeah, I'm really, this I got taken care of. Uh, someone buy me Metroid Prime. Uh, Neob Effects says, I love watching the recent Seven Days episode, the ones where you got the auger. I think my favorite Shima Hunter content is where you're goofing off while building and prepping for a goal or event. Thank you very much, Neob Effects. I was, I can't express how excited I was to get that auger. I can't, ex I can't express how, how pumped I was to actually get it. All right. So I think we're actually good here. I think, I don't think I need this anymore. The only thing I need to do Aside from fixing, well, giving power to everything. Uh, which, let's, let's just do that now while I'm thinking of it. Alright, so. Oh, you know what? We can just do, oh, okay, I need outputs. So, the, oh, that one. So, let's do, do that like that. So, we'll get this one up higher. Because this is my aluminum casings. So this one will be up a wee bit higher. Oh, that sucks about the coal. I need to figure out a better place to get coal <laughs> to, to the ACU factory. Unless... What is this? That's nitrogen. Oh, that's uranium up there. Okay, so... There's coal right there. So this is the coal I'm pumping out over to here. I wonder if... i got a pure coal node there. I don't know that... I think I may have just tapped that and not actually done anything with it. So I wonder if I could run this to Crystal City and let Ellie 
go pick up coal from here. Yeah. Alright, let's let's get this pretty much done. And then we will go and try to get that coal. Because I, I need... So ideally, I want to make it where it's Caterium and then my three aluminum products are the back three. So coal will disappear. Okay. So that's all good. Alright, so one. It's interesting that I would split through there. So yeah, let's do that. Let's let's tell Ellie to stop grabbing coal from here. Oh, where's the freaking end of this thing? <laughs> So is this Ellie right here? I think this is Ellie. This is. Okay. I don't necessarily have to be on. Okay. So, timetable. Ellie. Waterfall exports. So she's currently grabbing coal. I don't want her to grab coal from here anymore. Alright, she's only getting Caterium now. So she goes waterfall exports, aluminum exports. So from aluminum export, she's grabbing plastic. And I can send her over to... Let's go ahead and say uh, Crystal City X. No, uh, Crystal... Yeah, Crystal City Exports. And we'll... What did I just hit? Crystal City Exports. And have her grab coal. Which doesn't exist there yet, but will at some point. Okay, so that means coal. Who are you? Reamer. What the heck is Reamer doing here? What? What are you grabbing from, huh? Reamer, are you doing anything? I don't think I don't think Reamer's doing anything right now, you guys. I think he's just kind of going around picking up whatever, just ruining things. You know what? Let's just do. We'll say waterfall imports and get rid of exports so that way it's not it's literally not doing anything oh reamer's just having fun just having fun you guys okay so that means caterium still be the front one here that's fine whatever but coal will no longer be coming from this station so we'll get rid of this And that. Whatever the heck's happening here. There's the warden wagon. Again, I don't think... Yeah, I can't name it. I'm sorry. I wish I could, but I can't. That's just going to back up. Oh, what did I do? Did I... What the... What? Oh. Oh, it's going up now. Okay. Alright. That's correct. So, 
So this is all. So that is eating it. It's just going very slowly. Okay. Alright, so this you now get rid of. that to speed up the process. Well, what are you doing, buddy? Wait, wait, do you think you see a ghost or something? What's happening here? Oh, come on. I believe in you. I'm actually going to do that and then porch a bunch of this stuff. Okay. Who is that? Ashwash, brand new Prime Warden. Thank you very much, Ashwash. Welcome to the Wardens. Thank you so much for joining us. Okay. So this is good now. This will all go away. Okay, so now my lines from here go up. The coal only feeds the station over there and here. Please, please, please don't let me forget to go back and uh, and and fix that coal where the coal is actually okay, so this is this is filling this guy and this is overflow just feeding this one so that's fine. Uh, let me don't don't let me forget to go and um, and and fix up the coal station up over on uh, the Crystal City stuff. If I forget that, that's bad news. Okay. All right. So this is all gonna be. This is going to be our um, our aluminum. Okay. So aluminum will feed into all of these machines. It'll split off. Also feed into these machines. These are... Are they all set up? These are all set up. Um, let me figure out my belt situation here. So I've got these three belts in the back. So these are all going to be. Well, I had all these like these half foundations, and I don't need them anymore. I can just do a full foundation. Okay. All right. So this belt. And this belt can basically merge and go up into one of them. So this is going to be my all-clad sheeting, right? So these are actually pretty important. So, so I want that here. All right. So one that way. And then you there to there. Cool. Okay, so these are my all clad belts. They go up in there. Now then I can get 
these guys. Actually, what I could do. All right, so it's dead center or like off of that thing. Okay, so what I'll do. Is I will say yes to the dress. Like that. That is. Is that. No, that's not right. That's not way off. I was like, that's way off, but it's not way off. It's actually good. Okay. Beautiful. You are beautiful and every single way. Oh, come on. I'm off one. <laughs> I'm off one. I'm off one click, you guys. That sucks. Okay, so this needs to be just beyond here. There. And although you know I could just go oh, man, I can just do that. Oh, yeah, let's just let's do a thing. Let's do, let's make it look cool. Okay. So we're gonna do this. Do this. We're gonna do like that. Like that. This ooh, will this actually why is that crooked? Do you see that? Look at that. It's like not what is Oh you know what? It's because it's not straight. Derp. There it is. Alright, so it's literally right on the line here, so that's good. There we go. All right. So that is my... What What is this thing spitting out? Aluminum casings coming out of this guy. And out of these guys... We're gonna have... A good time. Merger. All right, what is it actually? In this one. There it is. And these are making my empty fluid tank. So sixty, one twenty, uh, fast. go and that goes up there I don't know if these are all connected to the train station they are look at that beautiful go. Make sure these are all set to load. 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 And too much. Alright. Perfect. Alright, so these are all set up now. They just need power. Okay. 
these are all online. Always gonna be the best place to connect with these guys. Oh nice, can I just do it straight across? Oh that's gorgeous. Come on. Come on, I'll save. say like here-ish. There we go. Those aren't exactly straight, but whatever. All right. So these are all, these are all connected to each other. They're not, okay. So let me run this guy to here. Are you clipping? You are. Oh, you're not clipping. Looks so much better now. You look beautiful. And you are attached to those guys, so you can come all this away. And now, those should all have power. So these are all with power now. Beautiful. Beautiful, you guys. So, I just need... Who was not doing... Was it Reamer? Who, who was the one not doing anything? I don't think it was Reamer, right? Like, Reamer's doing nothing right now. Reamer can go get me some copper. Right? Is that who it was? It was Reamer. Okay. Yeah, timetable. Reamer. I want you... to go to my... copper exports. And... load only... Copper ingots. Save. And then come over to my. This is waterfall. Waterfall imports. And give me unload only copper. Copper waterfall. Save. All right. So that's happening. Let's assume. <laughs> okay, I think I set it up where copper is the first line. So, copper will be going down, coming to this guy. Boxite? What the hell do I have boxite here? Oh, because freaking Reamer. That's why. Stupid. Okay. Oh, no, that means there's boxite down. In the oh, suck. Okay. Um. Where's my, yeah, here we go. Okay, get rid of the rest of this box site before it becomes an issue. Although now, oh no! <sighs> Stupid cat. Okay, that's frustrating. Alright, what can I do? Do I have any recipes that take bauxite? I don't think I do. Oh, suck. Okay. Oh, man, does that mean I have to torch all of this? Alright, if I do this, and this, and just really sloppily... wonder yeah that's pretty gross but it worked 
<laughs> so, how gross is it exactly? I'll take it. Okay. Okay. But I still have to go through and redo all of these. Oh, and a Caterium in it. Jesus. Okay. There we go. All right. Well, that was annoying, but... Oh, there's still stuff in the stupid splitters. Okay. Please tell me there's nothing in every single buffer of these guys. should theoretically be all of it. Unless for some reason I have to do both sides. I don't know that they have buffers on both sides. Okay, good, they don't. Yep, they do. Apparently they do. There we go. All right, I think I cleared all that out. Uh, have a thought, I don't understand what went wrong. So have a thought, what happened was, um, I had a train, that guy as a matter of fact, right there, who uh, wasn't doing anything, it was just going around and for some reason collected stuff, put it in its in its uh, train, or put it in its in inventory, and then uh, just auto unloaded it into this guy right here, like into uh, this station. And this station is meant to only have copper. And unfortunately, uh, instead of copper, it was the incorrect stuff. And so this is set up where only copper is supposed to feed into these things. But because it was other stuff, it got stuck. And so I had to clear it all out before I had to, b before I could get it going properly again, basically. So now you should see here in a second, theoretically, copper should start spitting out of these guys. There it goes. So these are copper ingots that are feeding into this. Wow, very quickly. And then... There we go. And they're gonna be feeding down into these guys. And uh, yeah, spreading amongst all of the various machines down here. So that's cool. All right, so my copper is good. As far as I can tell, now let's get our aluminum going, which means all we gotta do is hypothetically connect this now, connect this truck over here. And that should be it. That should, hypothetically, is this still going? Is this all stuck again? Why are you stuck again? Oh no, why do we suck again? Oh crap, why is there coal on this line? What? How did that happen? What the what? Did... Alright, where is coal coming from? How is coal feeding into this line? What is going on there? Alright, so this is supposed to be silica. And this is a bunch of coal. What the? Did I get my lines mixed up? What? What? Why? What? Oh. Reamer? Did Reamer do this? I think Reamer may have done that. So somehow uh, Reamer picked up a crap load of coal from somewhere and dropped it off on my silica line. Okay, well, 
This sucks. Okay, we can fix this. <sighs> Annoying. Okay. Alright, this will just start loading up until we eat up all this coal over here. So, while that's going... Ugh, sucks. DMX, drop the light! Gift in five subs. Thank you very much for that. Appreciate you, DMX. Eh, pushing the button so fast. You gotta get past the coal. I can't just hold it down, can I? All right. Oh, nope. Still silicon. Okay, there's still some coal. I need Lindsay here. They're so much faster at this than I am. All right. Did that? Nope. That's still not it. Oh. And there's another one. Oh my god. All right. Is that it? Nope. There's still more. Man, okay. So what we can do... that until we're just eating up all of the coal that coal is like interspersed with it so much oh because it's still coming from here did I cut the wrong line I oh Jesus I'm an idiot Alright, so this line is actually, this is the coal line. This was meant to be, hello bird. This is meant to be the coal line. Alright, but this is not. This we need industrial storage. So glad you guys are here to witness me tearing my hair out over all of this. Witness me. All right, there is my silica. So good. So we've made it to silica again. As soon as it hits that wall, okay. What did I burn? It was just concrete, I don't think. Sure. Okay. That, we can throw the silica in there as well. This is done. Okay. That's toast. All right. All right. Just silica. All 
Alright, do you have any? Okay, you're good. I can't. What, how am I missing iron plates? What? I'm, I'm remaking all of the stuff that. Uh, There's concrete have iron plates in it? Or is, oh, you know, belts? Do I, did I put down a tier one belt by accident instead of a. Oh, Jesus. All right, I hate this. Deep breaths, Jack. Deep breaths. Think of theme parks. Thank you, Voodoo. I appreciate you. I appreciate it. You understand me. You guys get... Y'all just get me. Okay. Alright, so Silica is now... Back on the menu. So that's Silica feeding into here. So this should all be correct now. So I'm double check that my silica line. Okay. So silica is feeding from my belts down properly. Okay. Silica está bien. Just need to. I need to find. Oh, there we go. I can get. I can get two. What actually? No, that's not not even the right one. Okay. Okay. Just to get my my thing going again. All right. Ugh. So now this last one there. I, what? Silica's 125 minutes, so I need tier 3 anyway. I went up. Am I out of juice? I'm out of... Ugh, I'm out of freaking... What a day this has been. What a rare mood I'm in. It's almost like being in love. Okay. How are we doing over here? Good. And you're in. Right. And I just destroyed the foundation, because why not? All right, just again. Feeding the aluminum into here, just so we eat it. Oh my gosh. Jack has called me to sleep. <laughs> Night Jack, Jack Cosplay, you take care. DMX, drop the light. I'm doing well, man. I'm doing well. Thank you very much. How did I just get a notification for Jack going live now? He's been on for three hours. Stony Cat Palmer, I don't know. I don't know how Twitter works. Or Twitter, Twitch, whatever this platform is that we're currently on right now. Um, that is frustrating, though. All right. That's going in there. But I am not seeing any aluminum scrap. Because the water's full again. Because the stupid backup. All right, I'm going to flush that. I do wonder if I should add some sort of if I should do some sort of buffer here maybe like coming out of these three into a buffer before going on maybe that would be a thing I could do or I should do this is super annoying alright ooh look at that guy Aaron the warden wagon's coming. All right. Well, hypothetically, it's a big hypothetical. We is good, as they would say. So, here we go. 
Torchum. 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 And Torchum. What a rare move I'm in. Well, it's... Why did I... Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I didn't... I just had to break the... Okay. We just had to break the belts, you guys. All right. And almost done. You to you. You to you. Think about why? Why would it do that? Why is this thing facing... Oh, because I... Had to, that was the one... The one I needed to destroy is the one I did not destroy. Genius. Okay, here we go. Alright, these are all... Why are you not making anything? Because you got, you got no silica. I ain't got no silica. Oh, it's because you got coal in you. That's why. How about now? You got no silica. Wait, what? Oh, it's because you're facing the wrong way. <laughs> there you go. Now you're, you're just munching on some silica. Nom, nom, nom. Beautiful. That's going. Now, I'm going to empty that out just to be safe because I don't want these things too backed up. How about you? You got your silica. I can see silica moving there, silica moving there. I see scraps going everywhere. Good, good, good. Oof, Jack, you're having troubles tonight. Finally, I am. I'm having some problems. But it looks like we're now properly working and our truck station is loading I'm going item 261 per minute all right let's see transfer all stacks of type transfer stack split stack where's our pickup where's our truck where's trucky mctruck face there it is here she comes. All right, let's see if this actually will pick up everything inside. Mmm, sweet jump. Let's get a photo. Oh, wait, not as big a deal from there. Okay. All right, let's see if this actually does eat everything. Cool. Okay, so it took everything out of there. Perfect. All right, now get out of here. Sweet. All right, there we go. We're off. This is our first aluminum heading over. Of course, I've got no fuel. Where am I, where am I making my packaged fuel? Uh, oh, and I can't reach that because it's too high. <laughs> I can't even see because I have no gas. Oh, this sucks. Um, oh, God. Well, we'll see how this goes. Bird, watch out. Auto cars. Oh, it was already taking aluminum? Oh, it was already pulling it out of it as it was getting close to it. Okay, that's cool. So they're both feeding out. They're both taking it. So, sweet. All right, well, it's all going. <laughs> if only I could get up to the top. If only. <laughs> okay. Now, uh, train. There's Ellie. All right, so... 
Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it'll be over here. So it'll be my exports now. Hypothetically, should... It's pumping in something. There we go. We got our all-clad sheet popping in here. Oh, Ellie's in the stupid station, so I can't freaking check. It's still loading, though. Oh, there's look, look, there's our buckets. There's our nitrogen tubes. Look at that. Our fluid tanks, that's what they're called. And then this is our aluminum casing. So they're working. Ooh, okay, I can come here. Okay, shoot. There we go. All right, so I can get down here. So there's our silica incoming. Here's just a boatload of copper. I have way too much copper. All right, and here it is. Oh, it's going so slow. That's okay. It's meant to. So there's all my aluminum feeding into all my various machines. And so these are yellow right now. But these will start going green as they hit 100%. Uh, there we go. Look at them. Let's we'll load you up. Let's we'll see. Uh, so as the manifolds fill up, these will uh, start getting higher capacities oh, or higher percentages. But it looks like it's working, you guys. Oh, look at them slowly going up. Okay, that's... All right, that one's already at five. There we go. Look at them feeding up there. There's our all-clad sheeting right there. Uh, there's some of our nitrogen tubes or whatever they're called. And then here's some... Oh, look at all the casings! Wee! Wee! Okay. Well, it looks like we managed to do it. So now we have our aluminum stuff. Uh, one all-clad foundry not working, if I see correctly. So we got eight of them. They all look good. They might not be at 100, but they're definitely... This one's not getting any aluminum. Ours is going very slowly. So it's meant to take 30 per minute. I wonder if I just ran out of aluminum. See, these back ones are going to they're gonna be, you know, hurt the most by the splitters, by the manifold. So. And look, I mean, it looks like... Oh, there is... Look at that. There is some overflow. I almost wonder if I should do a splitter like here for overflow instead of in the loading tubes. Hmm. I gotta figure that out because, yeah, they're, they're getting spillover. You see down there. Oh, and then I'm out, I'm out of aluminum. They've used up all my aluminum. There comes another batch of it. Cool. All right. Well, this, I mean, it needs a little bit of efficiency work, but I mean, it seems to be working. Um, yeah, I just got to keep an eye on my aluminum production down there and whatnot, but it seems to be pretty good. I'm pretty happy with this. This is not the prettiest looking thing. You had package fuel in the warden wagon? To, no, I took it out. Remember, I like uh, Voodoo, I, I had it initially, and then I pulled it out to start feeding it coal. So... What are you gonna do with all that aluminum? Well, I mean, uh, all clad sheeting is you. Why is my fan on? Oh my God, that's why. Um, all clad sheeting is used for tier five uh, uh, belts, so that's what that's used for. The nitrogen canisters are, are the the metal canisters are used to package nitrogen, which I now. Uh, so that's these guys over here. Uh, so I grab one. There we go. So these guys here, empty fluid tanks. Um, I have nitrogen. Uh, that I can I can use in a packager to fill them with nitrogen and be able to transport it. Um, so that is that goal. So I needed those those guys, 
And then the the casings, the aluminum casings, I think I need these guys right here. Uh, I think I need these for something. I know I need them for something. Can you check the silica side, says Mr. Zerfer. Sure. Marcus, hey! I'm very much enjoying the 70 series. Thank you very much, Marcus. We're having a lot of fun making it. All right, let's go check Ooh, the silica side, or the... Ow. Let's go check the uh, aluminum side again. Wait, are you talking about the silica side on the aluminum? Yeah. How much? All right, I got it. There we go. Put that back. So everything seems to be going again. Over here. You think one more got stuck? On the silica? Okay. So there's silica feeding right there. I can see it. There's silica feeding right there. There's silica feeding right there. This one's not moving. Thank you. There we go. Now that's going. Misters or Misers Surfer, thank you very much. Beautiful. Oh, fall. That's why I love you guys. We're keeping an eye out for me. Helping me when stuff breaks. Cool, cool, cool. Look at they got going. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. I wonder if maybe that was part of the backup issues. Well, no, because, I mean, aluminum scrap never really had a backup issue. See, that's feeding out. It's that's good. So that one feeds into here, which feeds into these two. Take that out. That should. So these take 125 minutes. I think these are produ are these producing like 250 a minute? 300 a minute. Wait, what? Did I? So these should be taking in 150, oof, 150 a minute. Oh, there we go, 150 a minute. I was looking at the silicon. Wait, did I? 150 a minute. So these should all be at 166, right? Pretty positive that's how it's set up. Okay, yeah. So they're taking a 150. So it's 300 split. So yeah, so that should be good. So, why is that one? Okay, there it goes. All right, so now they're actually not backing up out of this guy. How are we doing with our water? Nice, the water is emptying properly. Okay. Silica. We got plenty of silica coming in. They're being produced, so there's no backups there. Our bauxite, we got plenty. Water is full. Still filling up pretty quick, but I guess that's okay. All right, all right. Well, there we go, you guys. It uh, it looks like we may have completed our aluminum. So our aluminum factory is checked. So obviously I need to clean some stuff up. I need to fix a few things. But for the most part, it's pretty solid. I'm pretty happy with it. What's the thumbnail going to be? Mylia, that's a good question. I'm thinking maybe our, um, our aluminum area over here is going to be our thumbnail. That sound good? Reamer's a troublemaker. It's true. Orpec, you missed it. The yellow triangle is more of a suggestion than a rule. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know if you missed it or not, but yeah, Reamer kind of ruined everything for a little bit. Super annoying of him. Where is my... I'm gonna... There it is. Okay. Let's see. 
where can I get a good shot? Alright, so if I do... Is that too dark? Might be a bit dark. I'm gonna have to wait till daytime. I was giving him good, good pets and he grabbed my hand and just bit it. Yeah. I'll do that every now and then. Cooper bites too. He bit me today, the little gremlin. <laughs> this is cool looking. Next time it's motors and supercomputers, right? Uh, Dirt Bear Man. Oh, crap. I need to go fix the coal. That's one thing I need to do. Okay. Let's, let's take a photo of this. I'm curious, this is going to be really dark blue, so. We'll, we'll, we'll try that. We'll try it and see if it works. Uh, we need to go back. Gate, we got to go back. Um... What are you doing? Oh, this is going to sting. Ow. Okay. Can I make a train still? Do I have enough? Oh, I do. Beautiful. Okay. We need to go and fix the coal in Crystal City. But I really just, more than anything, want to go get some Get some fuel. Okay. Choo choo. Motors and supercomputers. Dirt Bear Man. Computers want to be tough. Supercomputers, we'll see how they go. Um. Motors, I think we could pull off. Not terribly difficult. But I still have all that stuff down south, so I need to expand southward to, um, to that area down there to then hopefully... Um, well, I just need to use that area. I'm not using any of it right now, so... I might as well do something with it, right? I haven't checked on my tickets. I wonder how many tickets I've got. Oh, yeah. There it is. Oh, beautiful gas. 127 coupons. Not bad at all. Okay. Who... Who is currently going to Crystal City? Who's picking up the heavy modular frames? It's either pain or gain. Painter Gang goes over there and picks that stuff up. So I need to tell one of them to uh, not, or to specifically pick up those and not pick up coal. Ellie was picking up coal. Coal is in her second spot, I think. That sounds right. Give it a shot and see what happens. Okay, on my way back, and the coal's like right in front of us somewhere over here. Oh no! Oh no, that coal is being used. It's being used in my heavy modular frame factory. Crap. <laughs> How much? How much is actually being used? Ooh, look at the trees all lit up. That's pretty. Okay, so it's not. It doesn't look like it's running at max. So what do we have here? This is a minor Mark II, pulling 240 a minute. 
I can overclock this. Six hundred. There we go. I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. No. <laughs> All right. So now, the mark three belt. Wow. Do like that. What is going on here? Oh, it's not exactly on the thing. Okay. There we go. go. Logistics melt does 270. I'm pulling 300, so that means mark 4 out this way. Okay. Alright, so that's going this direction, so oh, it's going to be a heck of a Heck of a belt over here, but that's okay. Oh, what am I doing? How much? I'm gonna go steal some concrete from my factory. Well, perfecto. What is this? Oh, that's a bunch of just cool random crap. Good. No plates, though. There's some rotors in here. There used to be a truck in here. Yeah, here it is. It's a tractor. What do I got in there? Screws. Wow, this is old. <laughs> All right, you're fine. You can, you can live there forever. And be happy. Be happy with your friends. See if I care. I thought I told you to shut up. All right, so I need to get a belt. This guy. to Mark IV. Oh, you already are Mark IV. Perfect. Okay. We need coal. Bring us the coal. And then we can do a little hop over, I suppose. the edge with this thing go just beyond it that's fine with me just 
do like so. Save. Come on, you jerk. Come on, you big jerk. There you go. Okay. We got coal, or we got a belt feeding from there to the third spot of the train. Third is, or is it the second? Where's the front? It's the export, so that's number three. Oh, crap. I might... That might mix up some things. I have silica going in the second one. Man, I... I wish there was an easy way to do, like, a... A sushi thing where it's like, okay, you just mix it up and it's like, okay, it goes to the proper one every time now. There's not. So close, so close to it. Ooh. Okay, that's all connected, and now... And there we are. We now got coal filtering into our train station in the wrong spot but at least it will be going here it comes okay so now we can go over here and say timetable Ellie she's already coming to Crystal City Exports to get her coal. So, there we go. All right, that means Ellie is getting all the stuff for the ACU. There goes Gain. What is Gain? We don't want Gain picking up. Crystal City Export. So, edit timetable. Okay, cool. So, Gain is doing the right thing. Gain is collecting the right things. That's good. So, Gain shouldn't touch the, should be the first and fourth one for Gain. Beautiful. There they go. So it's working. All right. So now I just have to resort out the ACU factory with the coal for Ellie. But I'm pretty happy. Been lurking, but I'm gonna sh I'm going to the store for drinks. Hope you're still on when I get back. Enjoy your streams. Actually, I'm about to call it right now, Dwayne. Sorry, buddy. But hey, you were here at the end. The front is the opposite to the back. That is true. That is true. Mylia, you take care. I don't know if I I, I caught you before you headed out, but hey, get some rest. Okay. Welp. This has been a relatively successful episode, I would say so, if I, if I, or if I can say so for myself. Pretty happy with how Hall went. 
Uh, yeah, I just got to figure out the coal situation with Ellie, which I may end up just making another. Look at that. There's a normal coal node right there, not even being touched. That I, whatever. Okay, this one now works. <laughs> this is going over there. We just got to figure out exactly what it's going to do. What is that? Ooh, it's a geyser. It's free power. It's free real estate. The geysers are another thing I haven't really messed with too much. Where are they at? How many are there? Oh, dang. That's a lot of free power. I didn't realize there were that many. Are there any up, any up north? So it looks like that. This one is the highest one. The one I was just looking at. That's a lot of free energy that I could be tapping into. Yeah, so... All right, but that's going to do it for me tonight. I am, uh, I'm happy. I'm happy. We finished up aluminum to at least working where we're now producing all of the aluminum products, which is cool. <laughs> Dwayne, well, you suck. <laughs> Sorry. Well, hey, thanks, very much. thanks for coming in, buddy. Uh, yeah, that's going to do it for me tonight. Thank you very much, everyone. Um, we'll see how this continues to go. Uh, I am excited. Thank you very much, everyone who tuned in. Thank you for, uh, we're coming in. If you did, if you know, if you came in with uh, Shadow at Noon's raid, if you want to give me a follow, that would be great. I would very much appreciate that. That would mean the world to me. If you want to see my archives, youtubecom Patillo. That is where all my archives are, um, and they're in 1440p and high def. So you can go check those out if you want. Don't forget, I have a Lego giveaway. I'm giving away. Uh, I'm giving away a Lego gift card. If you go to my Lego Star Destroyer, which is right up here, it's kind of hard to see, but I built that on a stream on six streams and every stream I gave away a secret code to go along with it. If you go to the link using form in my chat, uh, there is a, a spot where you can put in your uh, your guesses. If you get all of them right, I'm going to randomly pick from the people who got it right and we'll give away a free uh, Lego gift card. So there you go. So I've been through that a long time ago, and I'm sorry that I haven't. But let's see. Who can we throw you over to tonight? Who's still on right now that we can go say hi to at this point? Oh, Andy Cortez is going. Larry's going as well. Steven Spawn's going. Oh, man, there's a lot. Uh, let's go. Let's see. You know, it's 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 tradition that we we throw you to, uh, throw you to Larry. So let's go say hi to Larry. All right. Cooper is currently clawing on my door. So say hi to Larry for me if you're watching live right now. But yeah, if you did if you did stumble in here, hopefully you'll give me a follow. I would really appreciate that. That would really mean a lot to me. And maybe if you are following, someday you'll become a warden because the wardens are like the best people ever. And I love each and every one of them. They're all so super, super nice. So uh, yeah, that's uh, that's going to do it for me. Of course, my mods, Christian, Casavar, and Zard, they're so awesome. I love them. They make my life so much easier. And, uh, and yeah, but that's going to do it for me. Tonight, I'll be back next week playing some more Satisfactory. Um, at some point, we got to take a look at... Well, we need to do a motor factory. We need to do a supercomputer factory. Um, but then we can maybe poke in the idea of maybe doing... Well, I haven't done turbo fuel either. But I would like to touch on nuclear. See if nuclear is a thing that we can do. I don't know. We'll see. But we'll talk about that next time. That'll be next Tuesday. That's it. I'm out. Say hi to Larry for me. I love you guys, and I will talk to you very, very soon. And of course, as always, by the power of the beard, we are bonded. Love y'all. Have a nice night. See you next time. Bye, everyone.